Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So as we have been talking about on the channel, we are expecting a lot more AR, artificial intelligence, to be rolling out with this year's annual Windows 11 24 H2 feature update. And in regards to this, back in March, I posted that Windows 11 24 H2 could get AR Explorer, which could be basically an advanced co-pilot, which will be integrated a lot more into the actual shell of the OS. Now, that video will be in the end screen if you'd like some more info. But in regards to Microsoft pushing out more AR in future versions of Windows, it seems now that Power Toys is going to be getting a bit of AR treatment. And this is according to an announcement for Microsoft's up-and-coming developer conference, their annual build conference, which they are hosting, I think it's between the 21st and 23rd of May this year. And it seems now that Power Toys is also expected to get AR-related features for Windows 10 and Windows 11. Now, just a quick recap. In case you're unaware, we do talk about Power Toys quite frequently on the channel. And basically, um, Power Toys is a set of utilities from Microsoft to help you streamline um, Windows for greater productivity and can be downloaded from the Microsoft Store and features a whole lot of utilities and tools that do not come bundled by default uh, in Windows 10 and on Windows 10 and Windows 11. Now, according to this announcement regarding um, AI-related features in Power Toys, we don't know much at this stage because obviously those features have still got to be announced at this year's annual conference. But here is what we know so far. It says Power Toys advanced paced with local AI. And it is expected now that the app could be updated, as they say here, to leverage AR through the use of AR-backed APRs and on-device ML models to power the new advanced paste feature. So what we do know about this is they are talking about a new advanced paste feature. So at this stage, that new advanced paste feature, although it's not confirmed, could be um, related to some kind of functionality or a feature regarding the clipboard that comes bundled with Windows 10 and Windows 11. And at this stage, also, they don't give us any information because, as mentioned, all that's still got to be announced. But um, it's not clear at this stage if the AR coming to power to us, if this is going to require a NPU, a neural processing PC or not. Because a lot of these AR features are going to need, the more advanced AR features are going to need a neural processing unit, as we've been talking about. But nonetheless, um, this is all going to be announced at Build with a whole lot of other information regarding AR and Windows and so on. But I thought this was interesting. And because we do talk about Power Toys on the channel, I thought I'd put it out there. And it's going to be interesting to see what this is actually all about. And obviously, if I get any more info, I will keep you guys posted. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.